Uh, my name is Charlotte, and I forgot that I was next, so hi. Um, this poem is called Fran. Last night, I laid in bed thinking of you. And last night, I wished it had worked. I wished that 12 pills were enough, and I wished that the fourth time was the charm. I wished you were gone, not gone in a hospital bed, gone with no visitors allowed, gone. The kind of gone that won't let me keep holding on to your name and my lips, your broken skin and my broken skin, our brittle bones holding on to each other for dear life, that is, until you let go. This morning, I wished I'd never met you. I wished that there was someone in our religion class with a last name that started with an F so that the alphabetical seating arrangement wouldn't have put your G next to my E. I wish I never would have noticed how pretty you are and you don't have to smile. The first time you did this, I didn't know you. And the second time, I was doing it too. The third time, I kept you close, hidden. This time, I haven't stopped crying since the first time I said it out loud, and my dad said, no, you can't visit her. She only does it for attention. And then I cried more, because I'm afraid that I might agree. I'm afraid that you are what perpetuates our parents' ignorance. I'm afraid of you. And you don't know this, but I'm not so strong. I can't help but think of our car and Promethean heat in that night in my basement with all time low in that crazy loud darkness. I want us to grow out of our nasty habits together. I want to be there to promise that you're still exciting with all the, that other stuff, but you didn't do your government paper, so you wanted to die, and he dumped you, so you wanted to die, and he dumped you again. None of these things are worth it. And what makes me so mad is that he, him, the one that put you in that hospital bed three times, he was holding your hand on the fourth trip. And I'm sure you love the beautiful irony but he doesn't deserve your hand. He doesn't know how to take care of your hand, but he can have it. If he wants the responsibility of keeping that hand away from blades and pills and cigarettes, fine. It'll seem easy until he realizes that you have two hands, the same two hands that stole my heart. Tonight, I'll lay in bed and I'll think of you. And I'll wish that it works. I'll wish these new pills, new doctors, luck. I'll wish that they're enough, and I'll wish that I'm enough for you to come back to.